Hey, what is going on guys? This is Dokkar back with another Clash of Clans video. Looks like we have our Barb King. He is alive, ready and to go. It's a good thing that we got our Barb King because we are in a war right here. Real quick before I start this video, I just want to point out, I don't know if you guys have seen yet on YouTube or anything like that. But you guys can see I got some sort of comment or something like that, but apparently it's some sort of spam. So if you guys see that, you know, make sure and just ignore it. And one other thing that I want to get into was the fact that I got a new intro. Hopefully you guys like that. If you guys did like that, please let me know down in the comments below. Also, I've been working on a little bit of the channel and those kind of things. I also got set up with the Twitter account, so make sure and follow me on Twitter at Redstone Doctor. Follow me on that. And one last thing before we start the video, guys, I know this is really long. If I did live events, how many of you guys would show up? If you wanted to see live events, what kind of app do you guys recommend me downloading and trying? That being said, we'll go ahead and get into the last war real quick. Just show you guys how we did. Where are we at here? War log. Man. Alright, so we did beat the Warriors uh, 27 to 10. That was a pretty good one. It didn't look like they had much participation. They actually didn't have any clan castle troops, so I was kind of okay with that. We did. What did we do? We did get a one star, or two star 70%, one star 55%. I really wish I could have done better. I did realize that my Lava Hound was super low level. Let's take a look at that real quick. Guys, it's only level one. So while we're working on those heroes, we will definitely be putting an extra work on this Lava Hound. I have been doing quite a bit of Dark Elixir raiding. So we did just get our king back up. I do have the queen sleeping right now. It'll be a while until then. But we do have 42,000 Dark Elixir back in our pocket. What we'll be working on is getting that Barb King, getting that queen, and also our Lava Hound leveled up. Jump into this war real quick. So I did get everybody filled up with a CC. Hopefully somebody got me filled up. Looks like we're 26 and 9, so a lot of people usually attack early. I usually wait until the next day. So I will be attacking tomorrow morning. We got the top. Okay, so we still... Oh, we're doing a 15. That's right. That's still pretty good. So I'll be wanting to hit this guy here. He's kind of spread out. Doesn't look too bad. This guy. Nothing too crazy. The Lava Hound and Loons. La Loon, I, I've been watching a lot of videos. And I'm really liking it. But my Lava Hound is low level. So we'll kind of see what we can do. Real quick, take a look at this guy. MHMD, right? Look at this. Look, MHMD. Let's look at this guy's profile. Master League. Take a look at his clan. Right? Town Hall 9. And bam, look at that. He came over and he was spying on our clan. Is that ridiculous? Have you guys ever seen that before? What cheater? Cheater! Whatever. Alright guys, let's just go ahead and jump right into it real quick and see. This is what I've been using. Let's take a look here. So I've been using 6 Pekkas, 5 Wall Bakers, 15 Wizards. I've also been using 2 Rages with 2 Jumps and a Skeleton Spell just in case I need it. Clan Castle Troops, it is what it is. Archer Queen I, Archer Queen I was kind of using, kind of not. If she was there, she was there. If she wasn't, she wasn't. No big deal. So what we're looking... Oh, this is perfect, guys. So what we're looking to do is we want to get just right into that elixir. Right into the dark elixir. So we didn't have to wait too long for this one. So let's take a look here. So we do have a drill there and a drill there. Let's um, go in from this left-hand side. So we're going to drop this couple those this couple those now that everything's distracted we'll drop in those wall breakers and those wall breakers won't do nothing okay well we only got two now so we got to make sure that we do it correctly that was kind of ridiculous stupid tesla okay take that guy out now we're going to drop two P.E.K.K.A.s, one, two, three, four wizards. We're going to rage this thing up. And K 
careful of that jump spell. Let's see, we should be able... We'll drop that king in there just because. And rage him. So we're going to go ahead and get that dark. Yummy, yummy, yummy. Let's see, how much is left over... So there's almost a thousand over here. Yeah, we should probably... Yeah, we're going to take that out. we got one peck of four wizards, a rage, and a jump. So if we drop the P.E.K.K.A., sprinkle in the wizards, enrage them, jump them, skelly on the queen, one more wizard for taste. We should be able to get in there. Oh, oh, was it all, oh, it was all in the, or, oh, it was all in the town hall. Dang, okay. It is what it is, 44%. 2800 dark elixir we'll take that i don't really care about the trophies we can climb back up that's not a big deal in my eyes let's jump on over to the builder's hall because i do now have a level three battle machine take a look at that bam 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 i cannot wait to get him to level five get that ability that is going to be so awesome guys we got one more attack and then we're going to be maxed for loot okay so we do have that bomber up there. We can get quite a bit of percentage and probably the builder's hall with just all dragon. So I think we'll stick with that. Okay, that's what we're going to do, guys. We're going to go ahead and do baby dragon this base with our level 3 battle machine. I wonder how he'll do against all those CC troops. We'll just drop him off right there. See how he does. Alright, now we're watching these guys, we're watching, making sure they have their tantrum ability, we're going to drop on that Tesla right there, another one on that air, so we're all gone, man that Multimore is going to do some serious damage, he's going to take us out already, wow, okay, so 42%, we're going to get the Builder's Hall, and bombs, bombs. We're going to get pretty, hopefully we can get a quite a bit done before we go down. 52, 52 two star, 55 two star. Couldn't get that crusher. Got that, 59. I think that's where we're going to end. A solid 59% two star. I prefer if we were in the 70s. That's almost a guaranteed win, but... 59, all baby dragons, war machine, level 3. We're going to go ahead and get that level up, guys. I am so excited to get his ability. And victory, show me the money. Oh, look at that, 59 and 59%. But the deciding factor was that second star. So good job to those baby dragons for that. Yep, done. Done, guys. We already did it. We already did it. Add that before we go. And 436. Okay, let's jump back on over here to the town hall, guys. We're going to go ahead and do one more attack. I just want to show you guys how I've been doing this attack. It's been working all right for me. In the next episode, uh, we're actually going to go ahead and go over all of the ones that I've been using for Dark Elixir. So stay tuned. Find out on the next episode how we Dark Loot with all the other army camps. But I'll show you how we do it with a little bit of Pekka's and a little bit of Wizards and a little bit of Wall Breakers. 26, that was fairly alright. Yeah, if it gets into too many guys, I'll have to just push this one forward. I think we're getting to a long video today anyways as it is. That's quite a long intro. Let me know down in the comment section if you guys are still here. Let's see, let's see. Ba -da -ba -ba -ba. I'm loving it. And we're hitting next, and we're hitting next. Do 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 do. Man, having some trouble, having some trouble. Five, one, five, oh. Someone try to po po. Hello. Okay, guys, we are back here with a sweet honey hole. Uh, dang, look at that gold. Look at that elixir. Look at that dark. Okay, let's see how we're going to do this real quick. So everything's filled up. We definitely want to get in there, grab that, but we do want to get this drill. So we're going to go ahead and play it smart. Hopefully I can do that. It's not my forte to play it smart, guys. 
Sometimes you just gotta take risks. And why did I split those wall breakers? Who knows? And that stupid thing. One, two, three, four. And this is, oh, I don't know if I quite dropped that just right. I'm going to drop those skellies right there in the middle. I'm hoping we can save some of these guys so we can get over to that other dark. Let's see what's going to happen here. I think we're going to get it, guys. I think, okay. So we did get that dark. I'm not even worried about the town hall. How are we going to do this? i drop one there, one there. So we're going to try and create a funnel right here, guys, real quick. Oh, wow, there's an expo on the outside. That's a little bit different. Okay. So I am going to drop a P.E.K.K.A. And we're going to drop, oh, i got two P.E.K.K.A.s. Boom, boom, boom. We're going to drop a wall breaker back here. We're going to rage them. Oh, I missed. Wow. I don't know why I have this jump spell. Let's just do it, I guess. Okay, so we got that. The last of it is in that town hall. I don't think we're going to get the town hall, which is fine. We are going to get a lot of this stuff here. Bam, bam, bam. All right, guys. So 46%, not really worried about the trophies. I am worried about that dark, 26, uh, 2600 dark. So what is that? So between the two raids right there, bam, over 5,000 darks that we just got within, I don't know, 10 minutes. I'd have to say that's pretty all right. My favorite attack strategy though, and I'm not gonna show you guys, but it is the loons and the minions. La Loon, or not La Loon, that's Lava Hound and Loons. But my favorite attack strategy for Dark Elixir definitely has to do with the balloons and minions. I will be showing you guys that in the next episode. Thank you guys so much for watching. Alrighty guys, and that's going to be everything. Hopefully you guys like, comment, subscribe. Real quick, before you guys go, I did get a new outro video set up. If you guys like that, if you don't like that, let me know down in the comments below. Uh, let me know, outro video, yes, outro video, no, whatever you guys think, maybe I could work on another one. Also, let me know about the intro video, let me know if you guys liked it or if you didn't like it. Um, but that is Doc R signing out. Thanks again, YouTube.